Dear viewers, I hope you are all fine. This Sata song video shows a case of bionephrosis associated with pyoureter and a large ureteric stone. You can see the right kidney and it has a small renal stone in the renal pelvis. A renal ultrasound demonstrated severe unilateral hydronephrosis. You will see the left renal hydronephrosis, gross dilatation of the pelvic ciliary system with ecogenic debris in left renal pelvis, suggestive of pyonephrosis, and the debris and sludge in the ureter called pyoureter. Now, the pyoureter is the purulent exudate inflammatory cells, infective organisms and necrotic sludge collects in the hydronephrotic collecting system that is passed under pressure and forms an abscess as you can see the left kidney and it shows gross hydronephrosis, severe hydronephrosis and you can see a large amount of thick sludge, debris, necrotic tissue, infected organisms. So the collective uh, collection of all these things making the pioneer process. Pyonephrosis is a term given to an infection of the kidney with pus in the upper collecting system which can progress to obstruction. Now the, you can see the patient is about 9 years age male child. Pyonephrosis may be associated and may be suspected when clinical symptoms of fever and flank pain are combined with the radiological evidence of urinary tract obstruction. Debris in the upper collecting system on imaging raises even more suspicion. Now the pyonephrosis may be caused by broad spectrum of pathological conditions involving either an ascending infection of the urinary tract or hematogenous spread of bacterial pathogen. Risk factors for pyonephrosis include immunosuppressive patients due to medication, for example, intake of steroids, Yeah, now you will see the tracing of the ureter. This is the left kidney and it shows pyonephrosis. Acute pyonephrosis and acute ureteral obstruction often presents with similar cl clinical and urographic findings. Ultrasound, however, can easily detect the presence of obstruction as well as the as it can demonstrate characteristic findings suggestive of acute pyonephrosis and thus allows differentiation. Now you can see the tracing of the ureter and a large amount of thick sludge, debris and necrotic tissue is seen in the distal one-third of the left ureter. That is the lower one-third of the ureter. So, this is the typical pyonephrosis associated with pyoureter.
Pyonephrosis is defined an in infected hydronephrosis complicated by infectious destruction of renal parenchyma or the presence of pus in dilated pilocalcellial that is pus in the pelvic calcellial system. Now again you can see see clearly see the pus in the ureter and a large stone is seen in the lower one third of the ureter that the distal portion of the ureter close to the ureteral vesicle junction this is quite a large uh, stone and measures more than 20 millimeter more than 2 centimeter Pyonephrosis that is pus in the renal pelvis results from urinary tract obstruction in the presence of pyelonephritis similar to abscess. Pyonephrosis is typically associated with fever, chills and flank pain although some patients may be asymptomatic. Now there is another term pyelonephritis is the inflammation of the kidney typically due to bacterial infection symptoms most often include fever and flank tenderness other symptoms may include nausea burning with urine urination and frequent urination complications may include pus around the kidney sepsis or renal failure so the radiological features Ultrasound of the pyonephrosis is associated with pyoureter include. Ultrasound usually shows dilatation of the pelvic cellular system with the following additional features. Ecogenic debris in the collecting system considered the most reliable sign. Then there is fluid flow level within the collecting system. And there is an incomplete or dirty shadows of gas in the collecting system may occasionally be seen. Again, you can see the left kidney showing severe hydronephrosis with hydrogenator. So the kidney shows pyonephrosis and the ureter shows pyoureter and a large stone is seen in the distal portion of the left ureter. So the difference between UTI and pyelonephritis is urinary tract infection refers to any infection of the urinary tract that is anywhere from the kidney to the bladder. A kidney infection is called pyelonephritis and usually more severe than the bladder's infection alone which is called cystitis. Pyelonephritis usually affects one kidney only as in this case. So pyelonephrosis is a pus in the renal pelvis and it results from urinary tract obstruction in the presence of pyelonephritis. Purulent exudate that is inflammatory cells, infected organism and necrotic sludged urothelium collects in the hydronephrotic collecting system and forms an abscess. The world of exudate is protected from the body's nature immune system and from antibiotics if not recognized and treated promptly this infection process may progress often resulting in clinical deterioration with urosepsis. which can occur swiftly thus this early recognition and treatment of acute infection of the kidney especially in patients with suspected urinary tract obstruction are of paramount important in pyonephrosis you can find some important information in the description of this video thanks for watching please subscribe my channel if you do like this video Please click the like button. Thanks.